67 Chinese traditional medicine and hospitals opened the A fever clinics, and the five out of them are belong to the designated hospitals. And also, one of the hospitals belong to the seven plus seven range. For all the hospitals, besides doing their normal practice, and also arrange 137 medical personnel in different batches to participate in other hospitals' work. And the second, we also organize the TCM experts, so the max masters taking the leading role, and the provincial masters also join the a working group, and they work together to launch the therapeutic plan of TCM and also include it in the a therapeutic plan launched by the provincial government. So you can find the two plans regarding TCM in the guidance. And there are 35 medical personnel from a TCM from Beijing and Guangdong joined our work. And we have in Professor Gong Xiaoming, right, the expert teams, and we also have Professor Huang Luoqi also led 23 experts of TCM arrived in Wuhan yesterday evening and earlier today. Right now, we had the A maximum with both Western medicines and the Chinese traditional medicine plans, and based on the plan made by the National Commission Health Commission, so we will work the following areas. So we will first earnestly implement the A deployment made by the provincial government and also make our work detail driven at all levels. And we will work our therapeutic plan with the Western medicines and the traditional Chinese medicines and to keep upgrading and improving our therapeutic plan and let the age traditional Chinese medicines play a good role. And the third, we will also conduct inspections to guide the hospitals at all levels to implement the deep plan and also protect the medical personnel's safety. And I also would like to introduce the situation of the participating medical personnel. Right now, the, all the medics, they gave up their holidays and back to work. And more than 10,000 personnel came back to the position and they participated in the epidemiology and the therapeutic plan and also the inspection. And we have 50 exports organized at the national level and they worked since the beginning of the outbreak of pneumonia and they work with all the experts and medical personnel in Wuhan and we have around 405 personnel from a people's Liberation Army and came to Wuhan yesterday and I also have around 270 medical personnel from other provinces also arrived in Jintan and Hankou hospitals and we have experts from Zhejiang, Hunan, Sichuan provinces. We will also send medical personnel teams to Wuhan expect to arrive d later today and also the following days. And we will see more medical personnel from a different regions arrived in Wuhan. And we also notice that the a public across China show their care, love and support to all the medical personnel. I would like to take this opportunity to appreciate your care, love, support and best wishes to all the workers at the front line and we also would like to give our appreciation to 
the medical workers and their families. And today is the China's New Year Day. I would like to wish them good health and safe. Thank you. Now, if you were just tuning in, we were listening to Chinese health authorities from the worst hit province of Hubei speaking to the press with the latest updates on the coronavirus epidemic. Now, official said to CM experts are helping to fight the coronavirus. Health authorities are incorporating uh, traditional medicine with Western medicine.